Well, days after the storm, some in the city were still snowed in. And now the city is investigating what went wrong in parts of Queens. Is the new city's plowing strategy to blame? CBS 2's Sonia McCone has details. Queens got buried, and in this storm, it was also covered by a new plowing strategy. Under the old system, the city had primary, secondary, and tertiary streets here in blue and red and gold. That ranked plowing priority. But for the past few years, it's been phasing in a new two tier system called sectoring. Three boroughs, including Queens and a few other areas shaded in gray, use it now. Sanitation Commissioner Catherine Garcia says it's designed to plow small sectors measured by two hour cycles instead of distance. Sectoring constantly. Conceptually, is really about keeping that truck in that neighborhood so that it's continuously plowing and never allowing snow to build up too fast. And she says it did that in places where formerly low priority blocks got more attention more often and sooner. And obviously, for anyone who lives on a block that is under a lot of snow, they personally feel like it was not successful. And we completely understand that. Queen City Councilman Jimmy Van Bramer says this block in Woodside was one of them. The right equipment has to come down, the right routes have to be run, and if something changed here and caused there to be a problem, uh, then it needs to change again. Some of those pockets were past the point of plowable. The sanitation department had to bring in front end loaders like this one from garages across the boroughs to scoop out those clogged streets. Former sanitation commissioner John Darty says he was impressed with the cleanup, and he was surprised to see the parts of Queens that ran into trouble. Gee, that's highly unusual. We never really had serious problems there. Uh, and when I found out that Staten Island had done outstanding, I said, wow. Staten Island is also covered by sectoring, but the system has been tested there before and was brand new to these parts of Queens. Commissioner Garcia is vowing to get to the bottom of why it didn't work everywhere. Maybe we did something and designed it in a way that they didn't actually complete in two hours. Queens also ended up with some of the highest snowfall totals. In Woodside, Sonia Rincon, CBS 2 News.